Okay, it is really easy to record yourself with your QuickTime camera on your MacBook. But there are a few things you need to keep in mind here. So first thing you need to do is open up your preferences, your system preferences, and go to sound. And we're talking about the input of the sound, so the microphone going into your computer. Now this one, we just have an internal microphone, but this is the setting you really want to get. Do you see how I'm talking? And it's going to peak somewhere near the top three or four. This is the little peak one, the one that just stays on just for a few seconds. So testing, one, two, three, four. You want it to peak in here. If it's down here, you notice I'm, it's too quiet now. I need to turn it up loud enough so that when you're talking at a normal voice, it's peaking somewhere in the top here. So that's where my settings is for that. Yours will probably be somewhere close to that. Okay, so we've got that taken care of. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to go to QuickTime Player down here. I'm going to just uh, click on it down here in my dock. You notice nothing changed on the screen except for one thing. It just changes and it says the word QuickTime Player here. There's no window for it, so it kind of throws people off. But anyhow, it's running right now. QuickTime Player is on. And I just go to File, New Movie Recording right here, New Movie Recording. And hey, there I am. Okay, so I have my QuickTime Player. I'm ready to record. The only thing now is maybe I'm going to add a little bit of light. So I'm near a nice bright window, but I also have a nice little light I can add. So try to get near something that you have your skin tones and everything look good. Take my glasses off so they're not reflecting that light. And then when you're ready, just press, you can see my volume levels down here look pretty good. Just press record. And now I am recording uh, a video. I'm recording, you know, uh, a selfie video with my MacBook. When you're done, just press the stop button. And then you can just go to file, save, and then you can save that in wherever you need to save it, okay? So that is how to record a uh, QuickTime or camera, sorry, QuickTime player using your FaceTime camera. Have fun.